So it looks like Samsung has a device that can compete against the iPad Pro. I'm talking about the Tab S6. Is it any good? Well, let's go ahead and find out. Right now, in the space of tablets, the iPad Pro is king. And there's nothing in the Android space except for what Samsung has been putting out. And the Tab S6 comes out as a device that should change your mind on Android tablets because it packs a lot of features. Now, we know the iPad Pro itself is something that is stellar. It's got a lovely display, 120 hertz, uh, which is really nice. Thin bezels, 11 inches. The Tab S6 also comes in at 10.5 inches really thin bezels, super AMOLED display that is vibrant and gorgeous. Just think about watching content on there, especially watching videos on YouTube, 4K content. It looks really, really good and it's sharp, it is vibrant. Of course, Samsung makes some really great displays. But this time, Samsung is packing in the S Pen in the box for you with the Tab S6. So what does that mean? It means that out of the box, you've got an S Pen, an S Pen that docks to your Tab S6 and also recharges on the Tab S6 which is pretty nice, similar to what you have with the I, iPad Pro, which docks on the side, while the S Pen docks at the back of the device with the groove. Uh, what's cool about this is that Samsung has created accessories that cover the S Pen uh, and gives you protection on that S Pen, as well as also keeps it safe so you don't actually lose it. So I like the thinking they have there uh, with this device. That's right. Uh, is absolutely awesome and cool. Now you've got two cameras in the back, which is totally different here. You've got a camera that um, is a wide angle, 30 megapixel, and a five megapixel a standard lens. So you're getting that wide angle feature built into the Tab S6, which is absolutely great. And you've got some really cool functionality with it using the S Pen, of course. So we know very well the S Pen has a lot of functionality with uh, the S Pen features. You can write, you can take notes, you can do all that fun stuff, but you can also use the Bluetooth uh, remote functionality. So go ahead and uh, take photos with that. Swap it around, take a selfie. You can zoom in with the S Pen as well. So there's a lot of features packed into this S Pen that uh, you don't have with the Apple Pencil. Apple Pencil has, uh, of course, a lot of great functionality when you're sketching and drawing. Those kind of things uh, are built in right there. Now, when we're looking at some of the other features that I really like about the Galaxy Tab S6, it's the fact that it comes with a Snapdragon 855. Now, Android tablets in the past have really terrible processors, and this is the best processor you can get on an Android device of any kind. And I'm glad Samsung's put it in here to give you some really good performance. We know the app iPad Pro has the Abiotic 12 processor, which is a fantastic processor and does a really good job. I'm not denying that, but the 855 is also a solid beast. This device comes with either the six gigabyte variant, 128 gigabytes of storage, or an eight gigabyte variant with 256 gigabytes of storage. Performance is great. Looking at Asphalt 9 on a tablet, gaming on the Android tablet is something you don't see. This is how good it looks. It's vibrant on the screen, it's sharp, performance is great. I mean, I had a blast playing with it and it ran really well. Now, Samsung's older ad also added a game launcher that has some cool features. We've seen this in other Samsung devices. What's different here is that you can go ahead and see, monitor your temperatures and also monitor the performance of your device. Plus, they're adding in uh, a built-in functionality with Discord. So when you hit the game launcher, which is not, was not here with the demo we saw, but you'll be able to go ahead and chat directly with your Discord friends. So if you're playing PUBG, you're playing with a group of friends, this is the best way to have your own private chat without having annoying people on there if you're joining like a, another group of people on a team. The Tab S6 has Samsung Dex built in, which gives it a very differentiating factor. The Tab S6 can go ahead and give you full productivity right off the bat by plugging in directly to um, a, a, um, a monitor adding the keep folio keyboard, you can add a mouse, you can also add in uh, uh, devices to drop in uh, video files. So you can go ahead and edit with Adobe Rush right off the bat. The iPad Pro, you can do that too. The beta is making some changes, but it's still a cumbersome process. And you can see how smooth it is to actually have that desktop-like experience. You can do it on your tablet, you can use an external monitor, give you just more functionality off the bat. And I think that is really, really, Good. Now, both devices are really nice, but here's the biggest differentiating factor. Now, we know the iPad Pro 11 inch uh, can be used for about $900. The Galaxy Tab S6 
is priced at 649 starting with the 6 gigabyte variant and goes up to 729 for the 8 gigabyte variant with 256 gigabytes of storage. That's how much you're going to pay for this with that kind of performance that you're getting there. I think that is really, really cool. Now, if you're going to get that uh, accessory case, uh, it's about $170 of the folio keyboard so you can actually do your typing and all that fun stuff and it's still cheaper than the iPad Pro. Yes, I know the iPad Pro has a lot of applications and I know there's still a lot to be done there on the on the Android side, but Dex I think brings in a lot of functionality a lot of people will like. Now in terms of battery life, uh, the iPad Pro is looking at around 10 to about 11 hours of battery life. The Galaxy Tab S6 is stated at 15 hours of battery life. So guys, make your decisions there. If you're looking for an Android tablet, this might be the tablet for you to pick up. It's packed in a lot of functionality, has the latest processor, it's got a really solid S Pen, some really cool features with that. Gaming performance is great, and it's priced starting at 649. Well, if you don't, you can always pick up an iPad Pro if you want to, and you know the features are built into that as well. So the last time we saw the Galaxy Tab S6, we did a quick video, showed some of the gaming performance. You guys were like, whoa, iPad killer. Let's see how this performs truly in gaming. Let's find out. So gaming performance on the Tab S6 is just really solid. All the games played really well, no slowdowns at all, and the tablet did not run hot. It ran rather cool. So looking at temperatures on the system, we're looking at about 88 degrees, or about uh, Fahrenheit or about 30 degrees Celsius, which is really cool for gaming for quite a while on the on a device like this powered by the Snapdragon 855 processor. Now when it comes to audio, uh, you could hear the sounds while gaming. It was rich, it was loud. The quad speakers, Dolby Atmos really did a good job. But also just playing that song and getting just a quick sample, uh, you could hear how clear and crisp vocals came out as well. So that's also a good thing. Now, 
Not to forget though, we actually did some PC gaming, or at least some PC game streaming directly to the Tab S6. Let's take a look. Hunt the enemy. Stay wary. Pick your shots. So when I said PC gaming, I meant streaming PC games. And this time I used the NVIDIA uh, GeForce Now beta app, and I was able to stream from NVIDIA servers directly to my device, playing Call of Duty World War II. It looks really good. Nice, vibrant. You can also use the Steam, uh, Steam Link app as well, uh, but you can see how versatile it is to take something like this with you on the road. In terms of the other functionalities you find with this, the keyboard itself is nice, good functionality. It's a really trim and tight keyboard, but it was good for typing. Uh, the S Pen is great, and you've got a lot of features with the S Pen as you would expect, and navigating around the screen is pretty nice. Now, for those of you who want to do some more com comprehensive work, you can do that with Dex, but let's not forget, you can still do some gaming on there too. Your Android games will work and run well on Dex, and that is pretty nice for me as well. I think overall, you are going to be quite impressed with this tablet. It offers so so much in terms of performance, in terms of audio quality from the speakers, you could hear how well it sounded. Um, and in terms of just uh, having an Android tablet that is good, that's something we haven't had in a while and doesn't break, doesn't break the bank for you. I think the Galaxy Tab S6 definitely is worth picking up. If you don't want to pick it up an iPad, if you want something that's tied into the Android ecosystem and some synergy with your Galaxy device, which you can actually get your phone calls and text messages on here, definitely worth it. And I think it's a solid buy. So if you have any questions or any comments about gaming on this bad boy, let me know. Otherwise, don't forget to like and share this video, favorite this video, subscribe to the channel, and always enjoy entertainment.